Hi, Mr. Johnson here, and we've got a demonstration here today having to do with acids and bases. And uh, maybe before we get started, we should review the first miracle of Jesus. Do you remember what it was? Well, he changed water into wine. And uh, today in chemistry, we will do the chemist version of that. So here's some rather plain looking water here. And here's some more water. Watch carefully. There's our water into wine. Of course, Jesus didn't drink it back into water, but here in chemistry we can do that. Bottle number three. It is. It's back to water again. Of course, if I want the wine, I can make it go back to wine again if I want. There it goes. There it goes. So, let's send it up with water again. What the heck? Now, do you know what happened here? Chemically speaking, I didn't change water into wine and wine to water. It's just having to do with indicators. The first thing I put in was an indicator by the name of phenolphthalein. That went into the jar first. Then I put in a base. This base happened to be sodium hydroxide solution. And in sodium hydroxide phenolphthalein, turns the color of wine. It turns kind of a purple pinkish color. And then I neutralized it with the third container which is acid. This is, happens to be hydrochloric acid. So uh, in acid the phenolphthalein is clear of course. So there you have it. The water into wine. Now this is also an example of neutralization. So uh, what, what's in this cup now? Well, I'm hoping you're thinking, well, let me think. Sodium hydroxide plus hydrochloric acid, double displacement, neutralization. One of the products is going to be the H, going to go with the OH to make water. And the other product, the Na, is going to go with Cl to make sodium chloride to still dissolve. This is salt water. I could drink it, right? Let me, well, wait a minute. There's something else in there besides salt water. I remember it's the phenolphthalein. Is phenolphthalein okay to eat? Yeah, it is. It's sold commercially as X-lax. Whoops, wait a minute, I don't need that today. So, this is your history demonstration, water into wine.